In the wake of a sexual assault accusation against former East Helena Police Chief William Harrington, the city brought in an outside investigator to take a closer look at the allegations against him. MTN made a public information request for this report. The details about the sexual assault accusation were redacted for privacy reasons, but the 18-page report also takes a look at some other concerns raised about his alleged actions as police chief. The investigation was conducted by Jordan Crosby, an attorney with the firm of Ugrin Alexander Zadik in Great Falls. The city of East Helena brought the firm in after Harrington was placed on administrative leave over the sexual assault claim. He resigned in March, just as the outside investigation began. In her report, Crosby said Harrington's tenure appeared to worsen many of the issues facing the East Helena Police Department. She quoted employees who said Harrington installed cameras within the office and seemed to be monitoring employees' actions, and said it appeared he was keeping personnel files separate from city human resources. Crosby argued that was part of a pattern of isolating his employees from other city departments, law enforcement agencies, and each other. She also said city records showed he reported working an average of more than 80 hours a week, making his wages far higher than for a typical department of this size, and that he apparently required officers to work significant overtime while not moving forward with filling open positions. The report also said East Helena city leaders didn't do enough oversight over the department. Crosby said several employees reported they had brought concerns about Harrington to Mayor James Shell, but that it appeared much of the behavior continued. In the report, Crosby said Shell admitted he trusted Harrington too much, particularly on the overtime issue, and that it appeared the chief had not been honest with him. Last month, Harrington was arrested on a federal charge of distributing child pornography, a case that appears to be unrelated to the earlier allegations. That case is still ongoing. In East Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.